Wow, look who it is. We need to talk. Yeah, we do. How can you just sit there being calm? I am not calm. Joyce! Joyce! Joyce, please! You give me a headache. Uh, maybe you could do it for me. Come on. What do you say? Friday, 8 o'clock? I mean, we've earned it, haven't we? <laughs> I can't be out late. I, I can't be out late. How about seven then? You'll be home by nine. Eight. Enzo's Friday. I meet you there. Eight thirty. I'll pick you up. I'll meet you there. Picking you up. Seven. Enzo's. But when you say date, just so that we're crystal clear about things. Yeah. So hop. Confused. Yeah. Stop talking. I need to change my mind. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. You stand me up. No phone call. No apology. Because you had to go to Scott Clark's house. What the hell are you doing? What are you doing? But now we know no because I've confirmed them. You're welcome. And then you say something like, oh, well, it's really hard to listen to you when you make everything sound like it's the end of the goddamn world. Son of a bitch! Son of a bitch! <sighs> uh, what are you wearing? Do something useful. You do something. God, just because it wasn't your plan doesn't mean it was a bad plan. I didn't say it was a bad plan. Where are my clothes? Uh, uh, Your new boyfriend, right? Yes, every man I talk to from now on has to be my boyfriend. Yeah, he does. He reminds me a little bit of a Russian Scott Clark. Oh, here we go. And move your lover's quarrel elsewhere. Why don't you two cut the horse shit and get to the part where you admit your sexual feelings for one another, okay? Oh, oh. this? Not a lover's quarrel, pal. Whoa! You are way off base. Oh, spare me, spare me, spare me, spare me. Not yelling, not ordering. Talk to them. Take me back there. To the left. Yeah, I want to go back. Because some magnets fell off your fridge. Yes. What eccentric. He's certifiable. Glass houses, just. What? You know, pot calling the kettle black. Oh, come on. I'm all ears. Two man operation. Two. Yeah, well, change of plans. Change of plans. Drive. I'm Good trying. Place. Jim, Jim, move. Jim, move. Set the viper slow. Drive. You should go on a date. I don't know. I'm thinking like Enzo's. Okay, makes sense. <sighs> Thank you. It makes sense. I'm sorry. I'm a little busy right now, but I'm thinking maybe we can meet up there, like tonight, like seven o'clock. What's going on? Ah, Detective Byers. Just watch. Yeah, that you're upset, right? Because I uh, blew up the car. Yeah, with me in it. Well, I just want to warn you of something, Joyce. I am not a mechanic. Yeah, clearly. You made a noise. I did not make a noise. You I didn't make a I really noise. Think that what is up with you, you and children? Choices. Children. What are the dashes? Well, they're blanks. There was, I think it was either an H or a P with the part rubbed off. Keep it in park, please. Yeah, duh. It was definitely a Y, for sure. And that, I think, was a B, but it could have been an A. What is your identification code? Identification code. You don't know it? I think you should stick to sales. Forget about sales. I want you to come on for me at the Hawkins PD. I have to look at your face every day? I don't think so. So we're walking to Illinois? Yeah, yeah, we're gonna walk to Illinois. You know, I figure we'll get there by like Friday evening. Okay, what's the schedule? That's weird, right? Why are all these magnets suddenly losing their magnetism? Jesus Christ, George. We're not walking to Illinois. For my sake, either quit your bickering or pull over, tear off those clothes, and get it over with already!